Hello friends, welcome to my channel. Today we are going to start a new series for Selenium interview questions and answers for freshers and experience. So this is going to be a new uh, series of uh, tutorials. So let's get started. So my first question is what is a Selenium? Selenium is an open source tool that is used for automating the test carried out on the web browser. And it was originally developed by Jason Huggins in 2004 at ThoughtWorks. Selenium supports automating across the different browsers and platforms and programming language. So it supports uh, different uh, browsers and different platforms and different program programming languages. So let's move on to the next question. So what is an automation testing? So this is uh, one of the most asked question in every interview for a fresher guy or an experienced guy. That is automation testing or test automation is a process of automating the manual process to test the applications or system under test and this automation testing involves the usage of different testing tools which can help to create the test scripts which can be executed repeatedly and doesn't require any manual intervention which means this automation tool can be anything either selenium or you can qtp or any different tool we can call but which is reducing the manual process for testing any application is an automation testing let's move on to the next question so what is an importance of a selenium and why should selenium be selected as a testing tool so why we will you choose any testing tool based on it some uh, some of the advantages over the other, other tools so one of the major and uh, the best advantage is it's a an free and open source tool because of its free and open source tool the most of the 90 percent of our it sectors are been using this selenium and this selenium is a cross browser compatibility so we can execute tests on Firefox, Chrome, Internet Explorer and Safari and it also a platform compatibility where we can run on Windows, Mac, Linux etc and support multiple languages like Java, C Sharp, Python, Perl and etc and it supports the distributed testing. So the term distributed testing is nothing but which is will be distributing among the uh, testing the uh, same I mean different services at the same time. Let's move on to the next question. So what are the different components in the Selenium? So Selenium has uh, four different components. One is a Selenium IDE, Selenium RC, Selenium Web Driver and Selenium Grid. So we'll see what is a Selenium IDE. So Selenium IDE is a record and playback tool. So which is very handy and best to use. So it was initially uh, as a plugin for Firefox. Now it is supporting even for Chrome browser. So it is a very handy tool where we can record and playback. So the commands which there on the this, this IDE are nothing but Selenus commands. And we have a Selenium RC. So Selenium RC is a remote control service. I mean, it is a remote control server which allows you to run the test scripts and we can execute this test scripts within the large spectrum of the browsers and we, we, where we can start and stop the uh, server based on our need. When we are trying to execute any uh, suit, then we need to start this RC and again once we end the testing, we need to stop the server. And we have a Selenium web driver, so which is the most popular and widely used across the all the IT sectors, which is a web driver. So this is uh, this helps to reduce uh, some over limitations on the RC where this has been introduced. This web driver is a different tool altogether that has its various advantages over the RC tool. And web driver is directly communicating with the web driver I and mean web browser. In between in RC we used to have server, but here it is directly communicating to the browser and it is used to nav it is used for native compatibility or to automate. And we have an, uh, one more component called Selenium Grid. So the Selenium Grid is used to distribute the test on a different multiple, I mean, different platforms or different browsers. So this is like a distributed kind of testing. So all these components are under Selenium. So let's move on to the next question. So what are the types of, of Selenium that supports? So Selenium supports uh, two testing types. One is a functional and regression. So in the regression, we have like uh, components like retesting and uh, regression testing based on our uh, selection or group of uh, uh, test suits that can be executed based on our need. So this is a short uh, uh, interview questions uh, tutorial. I hope this session is useful for you.
in case if you like my video please do subscribe to my channel and we'll be coming up with the more questions uh, with a series of uh, tutorials thank you for watching